Hello and welcome, today we're checking out Railroad Corporation. This is it's a train building game being developed by Corby Games, uh, published by Iceberg, and I thought we should take a look at it. It came out on uh, Steam Early Access about a month ago, and uh, basically what's going on here is we are in charge of, well, a railroad corporation. Building tracks, station, trains, hauling things around, making some cash. Let's try out a new game here. There is multiplayer in the game right now. Uh, sandbox is what I would want to do normally, but it's not in the game yet. There's also a map editor. Uh, but let's start up a new campaign here and see what we can do. Here in uh, like 1830-something. Early days. So we're going to pick myself a face, which I like that guy there. He seems all right. Uh, and what company do I want to work for? I'm not on my own here. i got to work for somebody else. So Picket uh, gives me an extra 10,000 bucks at the beginning of each mission. We got Kane, who just gives me a free train, or Harrington, who um, laying roads is cheaper. So um, the train's like fourteen thousand. The first train you get. This one's uh, so yeah. I'll take Kane Railway. I'll work for that guy. Welcome to the company, he says. We received a large order. Mr. Denman, an entrepreneur from Cincinnati, has asked us to supply him with five carriages of steel. Time is running out. Mr. Denman has spent uh, since prepayment. For the order, so we got to find a city uh, with a steel mill and find out what raw materials are needed for steel production. Got it? Then get a railroad to that city and supply the steel mill with necessary. Okay, so get things over to the steel mill, make the steel, and then send that steel mill to uh, Mr. Denman. Got it? I understand. Let's do it. Okay, so here's our map. We are in Bowling Green at the moment. We have a station there, and my uh, my house is right here as well. My office is right there. Um, we got to find. Where we need to go here. So we've got Cincinnati is over here. This is where our final destination is. We see our, our quest over this way. Mr. Denman is also right there. Um, and there is a steel mill right here in Barnstable Town. So steel needs needs uh, iron ore and coal. So I'm assuming there's some. Uh, yeah, over here we got some coal in Casa Grande. There's or uh, there's ore. Sorry, ore Casa Grande. There's coal right here also in Manchester. So we could probably just run a track from those two straight into Barnstable Town. Um, we could try that. Or we can just run two, one, one from, is that, that's ore. Where is um, some coal? There's coal here also. So we just do two separate trains, just run that stuff into Barnstable Town, just back and forth. And then, I think to begin with, we're going to need money. We've only got, what, 100,000 bucks. Let's see what we can do first. I do have a train, right? You gave me a free train? Yeah. Let's build some tracks. I want to go from... Let's get that thing started up first. Well, you know what? First off, let's just get a, a moneymaker train going. So let's just run a track from Bowling Green over here into Clarksville. We'll take the last train. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Uh, we'll go right there. There. And confirm. 16, oh, 17,000 bucks for that. So as we do that, the town's very generous. They, they, they rearranged the whole town for me. It's very kind of them. Uh, so now we got a track going from there. You can see Clarksville... Uh, Supplies people and meats because they have a farm and they demand all these things. So we can go back over here to Bowling Green, our train that we already have out, which is right there. And say, I want you to go from Bowling Green over to Clarksville. And I want you to load up some people. Uh, yeah, just, just uh, load people and then unload them in Clarksville. And then load more people up from Clarksville and unload them back at Bowling Green. Got it? Got it. I want to see my train. Where is he? It's what, 1832. Yeah, that's old timey. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, yeah, he's classy, modern technology. Yeah, we got there. And there he goes. On his way into Clarksville. So our goal is here. We have to have, first off, iron. We saw delivery. We have a coal delivery. We also have work faster for an experience bonus. If we do this in 180 or 820 days, we get extra science i'm not sure what that is actually um points we get extra points whatever it is uh we also have technology advancement which it wants me to do which basically means um in our station here we can do upgrades we can say add in like a repair shop or something uh at my house here we can add in a research and development department cost me five thousand bucks we also need a bigger house in order to do that which is going to cost me ten thousand we'll go ahead and do that and let's go put in the research and development department. There we go. Now we can improve our locomotives with uh, or develop new ones um, that way. So let's go check that out. We have a max. We have a, a like a big tech tree thing going here. 
So we got 10 scientists that are hanging out in our house. Let's learn some reliability. We'll put, uh, I don't know. Let's put um, 6U on that one. Where's the new trains at? Oh, the John Bull's right there. That's what I want. I want a better train. All look at his power. Yeah, so let's learn that one too. So I'm going to put 6 on that guy and then 4 on this one. It's going to take how long? 64 days. Yeah, that works. As soon as that's done, we'll go work on the John Bull, which is like a real train, right? I think that sounds familiar. Okay, here we go. We're making some money here. Here he goes. He's stuck coming out. I think we're making some money. He's full of people, right? Yeah, we got so... Uh, we don't count people by individuals. We count them by how much they weigh. So we got 36 tons of people. We just like <laughs> just toss them in bags. <laughs> um, and we're hauling them in to uh, Bowling Green. All right, let's pump that thing up. Okay, let's spend some money here. Let's go get this other thing set up. So in order to go and get our track from these two spots, we can't just build tracks willy-nilly. They have to be from an existing station. Um, I think, right? I'm pretty sure. Yes. It has to be from an existing, existing joint. Existing joint. Uh, so from here, all the way, we can't just build tracks wherever. So let's go get a, a one going from here. And I guess we can get coal from there. Let's do that. What do we want to do? Or we want to just go straight there and then pull the coal from the mountains. A little lag there with the uh, with the track building thing out. Um, that's coal and ore. Let's just let's just do this. So go go that way. Go in go in this way. If I can get you to spin you around right. Those are wearing out. Time is okay. Yeah, he wants me to build a, a maintenance depot. I'll get there. So something like that. Right there. Come on. Where right, I wanted you. There you go. Perfect. 20,000 bucks. Done. Rearrange that town for me. Thank you. Good people of, of New Orleans. Now we need to go from here and into Barnstable Town. Can I have you go... Yeah, like that. Perfect. Okay. Research is done. Um... Perfect. Let me go ahead and make sure we get scientists working on the John Bull. It's going to take a long time to do, but as soon as these guys are done, we can go work on that new train. Okay, so now we got a track going from, or a train that can go from New Orleans to Barnstable carrying coal. Let's make a new train. A new best friend. All right, best friend. You're going from, what's that, New, uh, new Orleans? Into, oops, did not mean to make you go already. Uh, into Barnstable. So in New Orleans, you're going to pick up some coal. How many coals can you carry? We can carry two of them. Okay. And you're going to unload them here in Barnstable. Okay. Now get out of here. And from Barnstable, you're just going to come back with nothing. Okay, there you go. He's got some coal on him. He's rolling in to Barnstable here. So we got to continue this track. How much money we got? We got 10,000 bucks. We're kind of broke. Somebody just demands meat. I saw that. Did we, um... Oh, we demand meat. Oh, hey, that's a that's that's a money making business, I think. Because you produce meat. Because you can produce. If I give you uh, if I give you grain, you'll make meat. And if you make meat, you can deliver it to Bowling Green. And there's grain right over here at San Bruno. Hmm, that's a money making business opportunity right there. I think. Let's do it. Uh, no, 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 no train now. Let's get the tracks going first. Let's, so let's roll it out of here. Um be a bit of a, a bit of a turn there a bit of a sharp turn and then continue on into here excuse me farmer brown can you rearrange your uh, your farms for me a little inconvenient thank you oh we went oh we went way negative okay we went way negative <laughs> okay i wasn't watching the price uh didn't i have twenty five thousand before i guess i didn't look uh okay so let's get a train running from clarksville to san bruno it's gonna be expensive Fourteen thousand. am i going to go in that far i'm not gonna go that far in debt let's wait let the game play out a little bit. We'll keep the speed cranked up and let things roll here. We're spending money, I think, on um, research also. There's some money coming in. We got down to 15. We got the coal guy running as well. We got to get this, uh, this ore up here running also. We'll do this one first because it's going to be pretty cheap. I wonder if it's better to just get the train running now. I don't know. It's just, it's really ends up being more of a, a simple simplified version of something like um, like Sid Meier's Railroads or Machinki that kind of thing. Just 
simpler version. There's not a whole lot of, of uh, there's no risk of trains crashing from what I've seen. They uh, seem to avoid each other pretty well. Or they just go through each other. I saw that one time. So there's not a risk of, uh, not a lot of signal managing and all that going on. I don't know the money we're just spending there on research. Maybe we should, uh... 31, 31, 31 days. Let's get that thing done. We'll get that thing done. Oh, can I, can I get something that's going to be cheaper? Fuel consumption less. Mm, that might be useful. All locomotives fuel consumption. Hmm. Maybe. Okay, it's done. Let me hold off on doing any sort of research, research until we get some cash. We can buy a new train. Which is how much? 23000 for the old John Bull. Can I just upgrade this guy? Where is he? I would like you to be something different. Um, I don't know if I can just. I'm sure I can somehow. I don't know how to do it though. He's getting kind of uh, kind of damaged there because he's he's uh, doesn't have the repair shop in here, which we need to do. Hmm. I would like you to be something different, buddy. This one right here. I can scrap you, but I don't want to do that. I can just yeah, I was just scrap you and then copy your your um your route to the next guy, I think. But okay, we're almost we almost have money now. We're almost no longer in the red. So that's something. So as soon as we are, we'll get we'll quickly get a train running from there to there, and then maybe we can load meat up on this guy to haul meat up here. What what supplies more? Meat or um Oh here we go. Passengers, three hundred bucks per hundred miles. Bowling Green now demands mail. Um, one meat, 7,000? Really? That's really good. Okay. That's good. We're, uh, we're in the positive. We're in the green. Or black. Or, uh, or yellow. Apparently, if the game shows it. Uh, roll in here. Give me some money. We're at zero now. When we are negative, we actually do end up paying, um, like an overdraft fee per day. So, we don't really want to do that. There's also an interest if we go, if we overdraft. So, yeah, we're going to try to resist um, going negative a bunch. That would be ideal. So, let's let this thing play out for a minute and get some cash in here. We probably have our, um, yeah, we have our coal delivery done. We have to get 10 iron ore delivered and we'll have, we'll have that finished. We can just use the same train, actually. Even though it's 4,000 bucks a piece. That's pretty good. And now we can grab our, I think we'll just grab it from this one over here. If I wanted to put a track down, how much is that going to cost me? How much is that? 24000 25 that way. 25000 Somebody broke down. Twenty-five. I don't want to go negative. Let's hold off on that. Uh, who broke down? Was it you? If I scrap you, how much money do I get from you? Where is he? From a train at. There he is. Okay, let's go in here. Let's do the first thing we're going to do. Let's upgrade our station. Uh, now, if we want to put in a repair facility, it takes two rooms. We don't have any rooms available because this place is too small. So let's go ahead and upgrade the shop for 3000 bucks, and then put in a repair shop. There we go. So now he will get fixed and repaired as he goes in. 12% right now. He should get a lot better in a moment. I assume. I assume wrong. Um, oh. Yeah. Yeah, repair there, buddy. Please. I guess I could add a station onto this guy so he can go get repaired, or just build him a station. It's only 6,000 bucks. Not too bad. Now, I really want that John Bull, because it's a fancy train. Um, but I might just build the cheapo, just to get one running. Let's just get a cheapo here, just to get something running between these two spots. So, I want you to go from... Uh, San Bruno, and pick up some grain. Yeah, three grain from San Bruno, and then go to Clarksville. And you're going to unload that grain. Okay, now away you go. Burn down again. Yeah, as soon as you get back, you'll get fixed up. You'll be all good. Okay, so I got 11,000 bucks. Perfect. Train 3 is waiting for him to get off the track. Before he goes, gets going, you can see this is how there's no, you know, uh, signals or anything. And there's mail. You supply mail. Does anyone else deliver mail or want mail? 
You guys want mail? Oh, you do. Oh, wait a minute. Train one. Hang on. Forget the people. Let's let's load up some. Um, let's do some mail. Five hundred, it says. Okay. I'm not sure if that's any good. Are you getting maintained there? Yeah, continually get maintained. Why, why didn't you get maintained before? Go fix yourself. Okay, now we got... Here comes our first uh, load of grain coming in. They're both red because they're both falling apart. Uh, let me go to Barnstable Town. Over here. How much grain? I want to see how much grain I'm going to get out of this. How much money we get out of this grain delivery. Let's see it, buddy. I'm ready to make some cash. Come on in there, little man. Loaded full of, of grain. It's going to be good. We hope. Oh, 9,000 bucks from one delivery. Perfect. So now that grain's turning into meat, which, yeah, there it is right there. They, they want it. We get that hauled back there as well. Um, so you, train one. I have a better job for you. Didn't I fix you already with mail? Did I do something wrong? Um, no, you don't. You don't want all this. Um, when you get to Clarksville, unload them all. But I want you to load up a mail. You're gonna unload a mail over here. Okay. Wait for him to actually get there. He's not repairing. I must be missing something because he's not repairing himself either. Yeah, so I'm missing something because he's uh maybe didn't apply it. Maybe that was a problem. Just continually do it. Just always get fixed there. So when you get here, you should pick up some meat also. You got okay, so you got mail. We don't have meat yet, but we've got mail, passengers. Okay. Now I'm gonna change that though. I want it to be meat also. Drop meat off at Bowling Green. Pick meat up from here. Oh, you can't because it's too much. Wait. Hmm. It's going to be good money, though. I just know it is. So, uh, let's forget the people. Man, I don't know. I don't know what the best, best money maker is going to be. Let's just do mail and meat. You can do passengers from Bowling Green into Clarksville and then just haul meat and mail back. That's something. Meanwhile, while I'm busy um, fiddling with this, I now have lots of money. So let's go build a track. From here. Right over here into uh, a cheaper way. 25000 There we go. You move that mine for me. Thank you. I appreciate that. Okay. New train. We want a... Uh, we're going John Bull this time. We don't have money for it. Don't you worry, John Bull. I'll get you in a minute. We gotta get a bunch of iron delivered. We can actually just use this train. What's, um... You. Why don't you go... I'm gonna... I got an idea for you. You're very broken. Um... Here, I want you to go from... Let's lose... This one. And go to... What was it? Casa Grande? Is that what it was? So at Casa Grande, you're going to pick up some ore, ooh, which is very heavy. Ooh. Never mind all this. Never mind all this. You keep doing what you're doing. I'm going to get old John to do this. Because John's big and, and tough, and he can do both. He can probably haul more than one car. Now, in Barnstable Town, we're going to upgrade you and give you a repair shop. Excellent. Now, uh, you can get fixed, buddy. That should be exciting. Only one train, it says. One train at a time can be maintained, but that should be fine. There we go. So you are now uh, the only guy who's... Yeah, we're looking good now. We will, as soon as he gets fixed up. Okay, money rolling in. Perfect. Towns are growing. Yeah, it's only 3000 bucks for the... Um, 
For the people? How much? You have? You were loaded up, right? Yeah, you have 16 tons of meat, 15 tons of letters. How much money do we get out of that? So we get three, like 3,500. 3,900. Oh, what was 7,000 was the... Oh, man. That's 10,000 from there. We gotta just take meat. But yeah, we got... That meat's good stuff. 3,800 now. Okay. Just keep doing that. That's fine. Much better uh, money making now. All right, John, you're hired. You're going from Casa Grande, and you're gonna go into Barnstable. Now, I want you to load up some ore. I'm oh, one ton short. Hmm. All right, unload that ore and get out of here. I gotta carry. I think ten of those, right? Yeah, 10 iron ore need to be delivered. So there he goes, team train four. We call him John. So we want to finish in 820 days. I don't know how many days it's been. It's been two years, so we're not quite there. And conduct five successful researches in your thing. All right, I'll do that. Let's learn how to make pulling mass. That would allow us to carry like an extra ore. Let's get that one. Put everyone on it. Done in 70 days. Then maybe John can haul a third one of these. And there he goes. Hopefully he makes some money from this. She makes some pretty good money. And then we gotta go, once we get that done, we'll get some steel made here, which will then go into Cincinnati. That's where we need to finally go. There we go. That's a lot of money. Perfect. And there he is working. Okay. Perfect. He's loaded with, with uh ore. Is he is this guy still working? Getting fixed, right? Is that what's going on? Cargo's unloading. Is it because he's f oh he's because he's full. He won't carry anymore because he's full. Um Let me try something. Oh, it just now dropped it off because it needed because it, it's been using it to make the steel. Oh, has it been eight hundred days already? Oh man. Okay. Um Let's see. You're getting maintenance right now. I don't have a use for you, best friend. I'll make you... You can haul up stuff up to Cincinnati, I guess. Let's go ahead and build that route. So we're going to go from... Oh, let's build a bridge. From like here. And then we want to go... Oh, yeah. Let's build a giant bridge. I want, a, I want a bigger bridge. I want a bridge, like a massive bridge. Oh, it's going to cost me a lot of money. It's okay. I want a giant bridge that goes over just the water. 33000 just for that. Perfect. And then we can go straight into there. Which, how much is more is that going to be? 110,000? <laughs> okay. Um, oh, because of the slope? That's what's costing me so much money? Six. Um, hang on. Let's try something else here. We got to go over the river, though. This is important. That's 62 right there for that. We could do that. That's very boring. Oh, is that like a tunnel? Oh, yeah. Can I have a tunnel? A little bit of lag here whenever we're doing this. Yeah, it's a tunnel, isn't it? 75. I don't want to go into debt, at least. Let's go. How about like a little tunnel? 77. You know what? What's a little debt? There we go. That. And then... Oh, it's done. Okay, now we're ready to deliver the steel. And it's going to cost me a ton of money. 116. We don't have the money. We're going to just hold off on this. We had 90, though. We're almost there. In fact, we need to do that. We'll go into debt a little bit, but... We get, we get, we would get um, a bridge. We would get tunnels. It'd be very exciting. Let me just wait a little longer. Let it roll here until we get like a hundred thousand, then we'll buy it. Up to ninety. Whatever, close enough. There we go. Oh yeah. Overdraft. Yeah, yeah, go away. I understand. There we go. Look at this route. Oh, it's perfect. We got like a uh, oh yeah. 
I don't know why this is better than going up. Maybe we didn't have the power to go up. It is 1835 after all. And we come back out over here. We don't even build a bridge. We just, we go on the river. Tiny bridge. Into another tunnel. And then, perfect. Okay, so we're, we're in debt. Uh, but we have a train. Train 2. Who's doing nothing right now. Who is going to, um... Where are you right now? Can I double click to get you? Right, let's go find him. Oh, he's delivering his coal. Once he does that, we're going to switch his route around. I'm going to pause it and switch him around. Okay. This apparently is full of of that, so... New uh, new route, buddy. Let's lose both of those. You're going to go from... Actually, I could have left that one on. Uh, Barnstable Town up to Cincinnati. And from here, you're going to load up as much steel as you possibly can, which is probably only going to be one. Yeah, you don't have the power for that, so you can do one. I need to hold five of these. And then you're going to unload that steel. There you go. Got to get out of here. Being refueled. Perfect. Train four. Oh, right. We're paused. Okay, there we go. Bit of an overdraft. No problem. We need to get, uh, what was that? Oh, five researches. We've got, I think, four of them done. Let's get another one done. Let's learn how to, um, let's just get some power. Overdraft to do this? Yeah, what's, what's a little overdraft going to do to us? Here we go. We're back on the positive again. Okay. And... Complete mission in 480 days. You receive an additional experience of 200. I didn't do 820. Ill. Oh, in a... Huh? It hasn't been 820 days. Did I start in th 1830? I thought it was 1832. I guess that would be... Yeah. Um, one delivered. Yeah, we're... we're uh, she's whining about us being in debt, but she can get over it. Okay, there we go. That that uh, com thing has been completed now because we get the, uh, the research. Uh, this guy actually... Who's breaking down right now? Oh, I was supposed to put in a repair shop. I did. Oh, you know what? I didn't tell him to actually get repaired though, though. Yeah, get repaired there. There you go, buddy. Okay, how much steel we got delivered now? There he goes. He's pretty quick on the way back. In the tunnel. Excellent. Not a train game unless you get a tunnel and a bridge. Got two of them delivered so far. Number three is coming in. Um, I wanted to look at uh, train four. Do you have the ability to carry three of these now? I mean, I have the space for it. Oh, I do. Um, can you load another one? Load up another one. Oh, there's still one ton too much. Is that, I guess, from trains that I build... From then on, now have the uh, the ability to carry more because I got that research now. This one. Oh, it's only the best friend that has that. That's this one I need to get. Oh. Okay. I only have nine dollars, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get any more research. We're just gonna let it let it play out here. And uh, and quickly win. Actually, we take John probably and haul it that way, and that would win it also. But he'll be there in just a minute, and we'll win. So I guess what we would do. Um, yeah, we could also have gotten some logs from here, from Lakeville, and hauled them in here to the sawmill, because they want logs. They'll make planks. I don't know where the planks would end up going, though. Anybody want planks? Oh, all, I guess all the towns want planks. So we deliver those down here also. That's a lot of money. And he delivered that. So, let's see. Who was that that just broke down? Train three. Oh, that's my new guy. That's this guy over here. Yeah, he doesn't have a repair shop anywhere near him. What else can we make in here? Cheaper maintenance. Um, filling station speed up. Oh, fills up the the, ore, uh, the coal faster. Faster maintenance. Coal warehouse. Fuel at station will be cheaper. Okay. I'll do that. Um, we'll do one over here, too. How about you... Um, we get two more rooms in there, right? We got two space for two. That coal warehouse in there. And let's put in some uh, 
filling station speed. Oh, I guess we're done. Okay. Done. Now, portfolio. Um, can I buy I can buy any of these? Research price, sa employee salary minus 10%. Mm. I'll keep all locomotives minus 7%. Oh, mm, that might be good too. I'm going to take this actually the cheaper track lane cost. 950 left. I'll take this one also. Okay. That'll do. All right. Next. Execute our first large order, and now it's time to deal with something even bigger. Remember I told you about uh, one shipment? We received an order. We need to produce a consignment of clothes and deliver it to Atlanta, Knoxville. Atlanta? Atlanta. Knoxville will be our starting point because it has a clothes factory. Okay, so we're on the corner of the map, and we got to go. Looks like it's about the same size map here. Okay. All right, we're to call it a day here, though. Set up an HR department in my office. I didn't look at that, did I? Hang on one second. I want to see this. HR department, that's a new thing. Required to hire and manage personnel. What's that do for me? Let's take a look here. There it is. Oh, I can hire William Norris to do what? Oh, you make the John Bull price cheaper? I see. Hmm, interesting. Okay, anyway, we're calling it a day here. Thanks again for watching. This is Railroad Corporation. It's in early access right now. It's on Steam. I'll put a link below and you can check the thing out. And I'll see you next time.